In Smash, there are plenty of ways to beat your opponent. You can play it safe and eke out a win, or you can style on them and show them what you're really made of. But there's only one way to truly dominate your foes. A zero to death. Taking someone from 0% to dead is one of the hardest things any player can do. It requires reads, patience, and a mean combo game. So today, we want to highlight those achievements. Here are the top 10 zero to deaths in Smash. Kicking off our list at the number 10 spot is a zero to death from an old legend. That was nasty! That was oh my that was nasty. god! What? No one expected much from the Shizwiz coming into Smash Summit 7. And although he wasn't able to make it far in the tournament, he gave the fans a taste of his glory days by landing one of the cleanest Falco Zero to Deaths you'll ever see. Right. Okay. Scoop. Okay. Oh, oh somebody clipped that. No oh! Oh! <laughs> that was nasty. That was oh my god. That was nasty. What a combo. That was nasty. That was actually nasty. Scoops high. Yeah. Yeah. He's just waiting until his last I'm glad he went for it too. Yeah. The number nine spot on our list is a zero to death that showcases just how good Terry can be. Whenever a new DLC character is released, okay. it's Riddles, always Riddles. Riddles gets on it and he just starts slapping everyone it, with that character. It hasn't even been a week. When a new character comes to Smash, you can never know what kind of insane potential could be unleashed. And at the Amuka Smash Cup, Riddles gave everyone a taste of what Terry can do just 10 days after the King of Fighters character was released. Um, I wonder if you can do down tilt the dash attack. I, I don't think you can. It's, it's slower than Ryu's, but it's very that, that dash attack is definitely similar to Wario's, man. It's just that you don't see it that much. That's nice, man. I was not expecting it to kill that, like, oh just like that. But God. What? Oh, oh my God. Bruce is feeling Mars. Oh, this is crazy. This he's is always running this back. He's dead. That's, it. that's, Three, oh. that's winner's finals. What happened? This man immediately down throw up air. Immediately kind of just power dunk off the top platform. Got him with a F smash. No way. Took his jump. Dead. Dead. Coming in at number eight is an ultimate play. But if you didn't know better, you'd swear you were looking at melee. Big D doing it in ultimate. Oh my god. What game more, is this? More of the same. What game is this, bitch? Wait, what am I watching? It's <laughs> ultimate. What am I watching? <laughs> Dome Park on the Grass 2018 was Smash Ultimate's biggest stage yet, and players from all over came to test out just what their characters were capable of in this new and exciting game. And for Falcon players, that meant showcasing new ways of creating the most hype possible in Ultimate. And Big D, well, he showed us just how hype Falcon can be. He's been doing this for years! That's right, man. He's, I'm not about to change him because some new Pokemon's here. <laughs> okay, good patience. Looking for the jab reset. Oh, the read! Oh, up air oh, three, a oh, four. Oh, 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 oh my god! god. Big god. D! <laughs> Big D energy! Yo, Rod is gone! Rod is gone! Up, up, air is string. gone. up air string in the knee, and the crowd is popping off! Big D doing it in ultimate! Oh my god, what game more, is this? More of the same! What game is this, bitch? <laughs> Wait, what am I watching? It's ultimate! What am I watching? <laughs> At number seven on our list is a zero to death that stomps on the tier list. Who is this guy? <laughs> what are we watching right now, dude? Ganondorf isn't exactly a high tier character. He's big, he's slow, and he's basically a worse Captain Falcon in every way possible. But that doesn't mean he can't dumpster other characters. When Ganondorf is doing his thing, he can tear you apart and delete your stock before you even know what's happening. And that's exactly what Bizarro Flame did to Strain at Kings of Cali 4 with stomp after stomp after stomp. Nice, nice really okay, nice edge guarding. Was, no, that was a good, that it's was good. A good. Ganondorf edge guarding is pretty tough. You gotta get those were some smooth up airs. Uh, Look, like he's the... already in the lead now. Oh, oh, he got it. No. No. Oh, no. He's doing it again. Oh, it's not gonna stop. Oh, oh my, my god. god. Oh, oh. <laughs> what are we watching right now, dude? Oh my god. Like two seconds ago, it was an even match. The number six spot on our list is one of the many iconic moments from the kid, Mango. Specifically, his iconic double dunk on Eleven at the Big House 4. 
Mango has proven time and time again how flashy Falco can be as a character. And at the Big House 4, his crazy style was on full display, as he pulled off one of the greatest losers runs in Smash history. Sure, Mango won the tournament, but what everyone remembers is how he put the bird to work against Leffen in the losers finals, creating a play we now know simply as the double dunk. Really amazing air dodge by Mango. Yeah. Uh, awesome presence of mind by Leffen too, but it just went Mango's way at that time. The details. Oh my god. Oh, that's oh, brutal. That's it. Oh, they does it again. Wow. The double dunk. He actually gives him a chance to tech with the shine too. He should have. He should have just down aired yeah. him. Yeah. Or rolled up, I guess. Coming up at number five is the moment Smash players realize that those impractical combos you see on Twitter all the time could actually be done in a real match. After an initial zero to death combo that was deemed too broken by Nintendo standards, Luigi fans were forced to head back to the lab to find new ways to elevate their character. But at Genesis Black, the perennial Luigi main elegant showed everyone his true potential with a zero to death that made fans everywhere rejoice. Okay, back here. Hold on a second. 98%. Yeah, that's one grab. You can take three more hits. Why is Larry fighting all these characters where it's like, oh, I'm up 100%, I'm losing. Oh, oh. Hold on. Is this... Oh, he didn't get the dare spike. He but could go He's all the way! Oh, oh <laughs> dude! Oh, no! I feel so oh, bad. Dude! I feel so bad. Larry just Larry. fought like a Ken. And like, if that's exactly what Ken does to you. And then now he's fighting another oh, character that no. like, oh, I'm at 0%, like, I'm fine, right? Question mark, and you just get blown back. At our number four spot is of course, one of the most iconic Smash plays of all time. The Wombo Combo. Oh, so of course so. Combo. Happy feet, happy Wombo feet. Combo. That ain't Falco. That ain't Falco. Oh, 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 oh. oh. Folks, you already know this one. Poor Zoo, Happy Feet, Wombo Combo, get your ass whooped. Those words echo in Smash history. But besides the commentary, this play is a tasty example of how stylish you can make a zero to death look in a two on one situation. Unfortunately for Zoo, he's on the butt end of this whole ordeal. Or Zoo. You've already seen Mango on one side of a zero to death, so here he is on the other, because coming in at our number three spot is Armada systematically destroying Mango. Armada was actually retired during Beast 3, but the way he was playing during his exhibitions against Mango, you'd never know it. The Swedish sniper systematically destroyed the kid's fox. Stuck, four, stuck, four, stuck, four, stuck. Dude, he hasn't even been playing for he's really four stuck in him. What the hell? It ended up as a brutal four stock, but in terms of zero to death, you won't find a more clean cut, precise, and destructive stock out there. In our runner-up spot, we have not one, but two of the quickest zero to deaths you'll ever see, courtesy of Axe's Pikachu. And better yet, you're getting four stocks for the price of one. That was emphatic. That was amazing. Mortality, are you watching? Axe vs. Silent Wolf at EVO 2014 is one of the most iconic matches in Smash history. Not because it's a tense, close match, but because Axe annihilated his opponent. FOD was probably banned to avoid the chain grab, and I kind of like the FOD counter pick for Max because with a player as technical as Silent Wolf, the changing heights of the platforms can really do a lot at messing him up. Potential stock gets the up air tail spike and suit to death. Nice light shield. Not even trying to get shield stab as the shields do get really small. And oh. another stock, Pikachu! He gets two zero to deaths back to back then proceeds to four-stock Silent Wolf, all in under a minute. Between D1's iconic commentary and Axe's incredible feat, this is a match Smash fans will never forget. Well, let's see. He's right near the edge. Oh my god! Destruction! Taking our number one spot is a moment that embodies the word hype in every way possible. Oh, Lesbos, calm down. 
<laughs> this is a statement right here. At B6, West Balls was on a whole other level, showing us moves and gameplay we had never seen from him before. And in the losers finals against Leffen, for just one stock, West Balls showed the absolute peak of Falco play. Well, Leffen is more on hard percentage on the on strong hit and position. Oh, and that's wow! spicy! Lesh Castle turn around grab! West Balls is absolutely going off right now! Stop, West Balls, calm down! Oh, oh the shine down! No! West Balls, calm down! <laughs> Why did that burn? Oh, this is a statement right here. West Balls isn't doing all this stuff because he feels he needs to. If there was a 20XX for Falco, I think it's safe to say he hit it. So that's our list. Those are the top 10 Smash Zero to Depths. And if you think we missed one or you have another idea for a Smash Top 10 list, let us know in the comments. And if you want more great Smash videos like this one, then throw us a sub. Really does mean a lot. Thank you so much for watching. Hey everybody, I know we usually mention this up top, but we are all shooting from home right now due to concerns around COVID-19. But I wanna give you a behind the scenes look at my awesome recording setup, which is my closet. Like my shirts are here and my girlfriend's clothes are there and my underwear is in one of these drawers. You don't need to see that. Look, I look insane right now. But the fact of the matter is, these are the lengths we're going to to keep making amazing video for you guys. So thank you for subbing, thank you for watching. And I have another top 10 to voice in my closet. And my girlfriend's very mad at me.